guys and welcome to the android dude reviews uh, today i'm going to review our uh, rom for the note 10.1 uh, the name of the rom is uh, gnabo uh, version 3 uh, it's a superb rom i have to say the best rom for the note 10.1 so far in my opinion uh, i have been flashing a lot of roms for for the note 10.1 now uh, for the past few days just to find the best and most uh, suitable uh, ROM for the 10.1 and uh, I'm out for quickness, smoothness, uh, responsiveness and all, all those kind of things and this ROM is just superb it's incredible fast and I just love it the for example uh, when I was uh, installing the ROM uh, you usually when you uh, hit next it takes a second or two or three before you come to the next page this was so quick that I almost was uh, I almost got scared scared that that's how quick and smooth this ROM uh, was or is so I'm gonna do a review of this ROM. It's not that much to review. I mean, it's up to everyone to flash the ROM and and see for yourself. So, uh, uh, so yeah. So let's begin. Uh, at the moment, I'm running a Nova Launcher and Nova Launcher Prime, uh, and uh, the the theme pack that I'm running is I think the name is beautiful no yeah beautiful theme that's the name of the theme and also the I you get the icons too so if this is something you like and want then please go ahead and uh, grab this theme from the Play Store uh, also this is a 4.4.2 ROM uh, KitKat of course so for anyone that wonders uh, it's a KitKat ROM uh, I will uh, uh, see here one moment uh, some of the things that you will get for example you get the 2014 calculator uh, you get uh, the new S note and what do you get more you get uh, you get the tab for keyboard also the tab for launcher it's it's a ton of things you get for uh, installing this rom i can't go through them all uh, i i think it's up to you to uh, make that call to flash the rom and and check for yourself uh, as you can see it's working perfectly no problem whatsoever and uh, directly after I uh, installed the ROM I uh, downloaded the uh, exposed installer and uh, installed that after I did reboot and directly downloaded uh, uh, what's the name uh, let's see here a uh, gravity uh, box uh, for KitKat so you can do your uh, modifications like putting the clock in, uh, in the middle and getting your circle battery and what whatever you want I can open up gravity box and show you you got lock screen tweaks as you can see you got tons of different lock lock screen tweaks you can do here if you want for example you can uh, unlock ring targets show battery arc enable torch uh, enable double tap to sleep and uh, you can maximize widgets example when enable lock screen widgets will be maxima um, maximized by default so uh, yeah and also you got status bar tweaks uh, you got quick settings management here you got a ton of things to change uh, 
you got a data traffic monitor clock settings for example if you want to clock in the middle uh, you got notification drawer style as you can see here notification drawer background and so on and so on and you can also uh, change the cost costume carrier text I have done that I think to the Android dude uh, so yeah uh, gravity box works perfectly with note 10.1 and this uh, rom uh, gnabo uh, version 3 and overall this this uh, rom is super quick super smooth and just super responsive i think uh, i will not change rom until uh, uh, i can find something much much be better than this if it's possible I don't think it is but yeah this uh, developer has done a great job uh, uh, developing this ROM uh, also you get some cool stuff like uh, I will show you um, let's go to settings you get some uh, cool lock screen uh where is it uh here we got it uh for example if you want to have a wave the wave effect for the lock screen you can have that i will show you that's the wave one I will also show you the second one that is the uh, what do you call it in English uh, light effect pretty awesome I think this is from the S5 but I'm not sure and also you got the coolest one is the particle effect this is the one I love the most pretty cool I have to say so yeah you you get so many cool things and as you can see the uh, settings look look a little bit different from before and I bet you got a lot of things to check out here that wasn't uh, available before uh, I haven't checked out everything uh, I haven't had uh, the time to do so but uh, what I can show you I will show you now so uh, let's see what do we got more uh, also we got the oops we got the multi-window working perfectly uh, uh, I got the multi-window uh, plus so I got uh, both the uh, four window and the dockable so I can use floating uh, window for example if I press YouTube once I can get float the floating window if I want that or I can uh, just open up like uh, let's say four apps uh, at the same time uh, as you can see everything works just as it should and uh, this is awesome I really really love this before my uh, note 10.1 was very very slow and very very uh, it took almost two days to charge now it takes one or two hours maybe three to fully charge uh, charge it so it so that's just wonderful also uh, the battery uh, I have changed the battery to circle battery uh, there is so many things you can do and change 
if you want with the uh, uh, gravity box uh, also in uh, with exposed installer for the people who doesn't know how exposed installer works I will explain once again for uh, the 10.1 firstly uh, after you have installed the ROM you go to uh, framework and then you hit uh, install update and after you have done that you reboot your device after you have uh, rebooted your device uh, you come back to uh, uh, to the exposed installer and you go to modules and here you activate all the modules that you want for your 10.1 and uh, after you have done that you have to reboot again for activate the, uh, the modules so yeah and you can also download modules but you have to be very careful so they are uh, so the modules are for your uh, for your device so there are a ton of modules that you can download but be careful and read before you download anything and activate anything uh, as you can see now my uh, uh, my uh, pad is pretty fresh I haven't installed that many things so uh, I don't got that many things to show but uh, I can show you for example the new keyboard that you get this is the new keyboard uh, if you want to use uh, many languages for example uh, my wife uh, likes to use my uh, pad uh, for schoolwork and, and, and so on and so on uh, all you have to do is press this uh, globe and it switches language to Thai or whatever language you want and if you want to come back to uh, Swedish then you just press it once uh, again uh, so that's pretty awesome and also I will show you uh, the pen window uh, I'm using a different uh, theme uh, this is not the pen window you get when you install the ROM uh, I, I'm, I think it's Kalagas theme I'm using for uh, this ROM and for also for the pen window as you can see this is Kalagas work beautiful work by the way Kalagas uh, this guy is doing some beautiful themes uh, I really love his work and I'm gonna keep on uh, flashing all his work for both uh, my 10.1 and for my Note 3 if there is for uh, any for the note tree I'm not sure but anyways uh, what do we got more here to show um, yeah I can also show you guys the the here you can see the model number is GTN8000 and the Android version is 4.4.2 and the baseband version is uh, DND2 so this is 4.4.2 KitKat in full effect so for anyone who wants to flash this ROM I highly recommend this ROM for anyone we don't know 10.1 uh, this is uh, available for the 8000 for the I think this is available for all three uh, different models so uh, please before you do anything read up and check uh, on the XDA forum so you flash the correct uh, uh, ROM for your model uh, I will post a link in the description for uh, 
for this ROM so for anyone who wants to flash this ROM just go ahead but please before you do so do your backups do your uh, EFS backups and everything so if something goes wrong you will always be on the safe side that's the most important thing you can do so yeah uh, I'm thinking what more is there to show uh, the calculator for example is the 2014 calculator as you can see here uh, I'm not using the calculator that much so I only show you guys uh, the things that you get uh, also flash player is working perfectly with uh, with uh, Dolphin browser and Dolphin jetpack and uh, yeah I think that's about all folks uh, uh, what do we got more no I don't think it there is much more to show uh, anyways guys if there is anyone who wants uh, wants to flash this ROM I will post a link in the description and uh, head over to the XDA forum read up and if this is something uh, you like uh, please go ahead and flash it but as I said before do your reading and do your backups and all of those things and one more thing before we end this uh, review uh, from all the ROMs that I have uh, been flashing and that is a million uh, ROMs to be honest this is the best uh, ROM of all for the Note 10.1 and I mean many people are still stuck uh, on jelly bean and why stay on jelly bean when you can stay on KitKat 4.4.2 and run at superb speed uh, uh, have super smoothness super quickness super responsiveness and all of those things so yeah I recommend this one for everyone and until I find uh, something better I will post a video directly uh, for all the note uh, 10.1 users so I want to say thank you for watching the video and see you in the next uh, video uh, so yeah take care and bye bye